Hey, hey guys. guys! Welcome back. We're the Puzzle Couple. And we're here with a new puzzle. This one's going to be an interesting one. It so is. Wanna... And look how classic, classically mm. beautiful this puzzle is. This is a wooden puzzle, the Wallace Collection. Mm -hmm. A Wentworth wooden jigsaw. Isn't that just gorgeous? And the name of it is Madame de Pompadour uh, by Francis Beauchard, uh, from I guess he lived from 1703 to 1770. So pretty cool. So I'm sure you could go to museums and see this somewhere. Yeah, now this know. is 250 pieces. Yeah. And the pieces are... Oh, look how beautiful it comes in a really nice little bag yeah it's like they went all out on this puppy they did yeah. i'm gonna keep this one i'm gonna tell the puzzle group after they're done with it to give it back to give it back oh wow yeah look at that oh how cool look it has a little sword <laughs> it's one cool of the things that? yeah see these pieces yeah this is gonna be interesting because these are this looks like a little castle uh you got uh, oh, like a candle thingy yeah the eiffel tower is that what that is That's yeah. so cute. picture frame so not everything is something here's a gun i think when i was telling my dad about this i showed him the gun but i don't yeah. think he i'm understands. not sure what that is but that oh maybe that's a oh that's a cannon there we go have it up the right way so but yeah some of these actually have some pieces other things don't oh i think this is the oh gosh i can't remember what they call that in in france uh, but that that little that's a that's a pretty famous place there so i think this is going to be harder because with wind puzzles you go by the color um scheme i there's what i was told to uh -huh. put it together but all these are are really dark. Yeah, they're very dark. So, so it's going to be an interesting yeah. type of thing. And I don't know if you can tell the edge. I mean, maybe that's an edge. Like right there. See? Because that looks pretty, you know, pretty straight. <laughs> so maybe that's an edge piece. Yeah, maybe this is an edge piece too. I'm going to put the edge pieces to the side. What you think the edge pieces are? Yeah, so we'll see. we'll see. But hopefully you guys enjoy watching us do this here and uh this will be this will be an interesting, yeah, experience. So Yeah, and if you watch it, you can always kind of watch a little bit of the middle or skip to the end. Mm -hmm. We will talk about what we liked and didn't like about the puzzle yeah. and um you know, the one thing I like right now is there's no puzzle dust. <laughs> yeah. So. I guess with the wooden puzzle, there's probably a lot less dust than, probably. than others. Yeah. Uh, and also, uh, go ahead and like and subscribe. And we will talk to you at the end, I guess. All right. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.
hey guys. guys so we're back yep and we did it if you notice yes it took a while it took longer than i thought i thought mm -hmm. we'd like get the pieces out and done but um whereas the other ones that we did that were wooden were more colorful so mm -hmm. it was easier to group together yeah. this was very a, dark yeah very dark yeah. but once the picture was like together it was beautiful yeah. and i just want to say that the way the artist painted her eyes is amazing it really felt like she was just looking out from from the wood so it was just a gorgeous gorgeous picture very it was very very cool now i'm sure the original because what you see on the box it looks a little brighter, mm -hmm. uh, but the puzzle itself is very dark. Uh, so I'm sure the painting in a museum or wherever it's at is probably a much brighter one. I think they just kind of muted it to make it a little bit harder to put together. Or, yeah, the wood. Do you think no, the wood, might the wood have could have darker? Yeah, it could have. Did know. it seem like it was... Maybe there's no way they could have painted it on. No, no, it wasn't painted okay. on. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it was just so gorgeous. It I was loved very, it. Very cool. And it, it was I think it was pretty neat that it had little shapes in there and everything else. Yeah. Like the little flag actually um had little lines in it that you could actually see through. Them. Yeah. So it's the cutting of that must have been crazy. I don't know how they do that, how they make those so small to yeah. fit together as good as they do, you know. So, it's I wonder if crazy. they have a video on it. Yeah, they might. Maybe. But how do they make wooden puzzles? That would be a cool thing. Maybe we'll have to look into that. Oh, we'll definitely have to look into that. Yeah. But anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. It, like we said, it was not necessarily an easy one, but it wasn't. Mm -hmm. It wasn't super hard because I think it only took about three hours probably to do. Probably, yeah. You know, so. Eh. Not that bad for us. No. So, yeah. so, and it's always neat to do these wooden puzzles, I think. Yeah. You know? We because have they one do. more. They do have some interesting shapes and the way they come together. It's always kind of interesting. You got to be careful because oh. you hit one little thing, it breaks them apart kind of thing. So, you yeah. got to put it back together. Uh, but, hey, you know, that's pretty fun still. It was. And there's like a satisfaction mm -hmm. in getting the pieces to um like fall into place right yeah yeah like even when they don't really connect because they just have little grooves that you put the other grooves against i don't know there's just something so satisfactory in having that yeah, yeah. together so very true very true all right, guys, go ahead and like and subscribe to our channel, and we will be back with another one. We will. Bye. <laughs> Bye.